What's up guys, Dick in here, and Grand Theft Auto 5, aka Grand Theft Auto Online, has announced new free DLC coming out, and it's called the Exclusive and Other Crimes Update. Release date December 15th, so it's in 15 days. Now, for me, Grand Theft Auto Online has gotten really bad lately. Like, lately, I guess it has been really bad, to be honest. All that game is right now, it's about, hey, buy this overpriced stuff that you don't really need, that you already own, and burn out all the money you have so you can buy shark cards with real money to get fake money. That's all I see Grand Theft Auto being nowadays. It's like, hey, we have new high-end apartments that probably cost millions of dollars that they want you to pay real money for. We have new cars, and you can have this boat yacht thing. That's it. That's all I saw in this update. These updates are stupidly ridiculous. I'm not even going to probably play it. I mean, I don't know. I do kind of want to see what the boat is. And I do kind of want to just get on it to make sure, you know, the prices are crazy and make another video about it. But gosh, all I see from Grand Theft Auto Online is here's some free DLC, but it's not free DLC. It's a very expensive in-game currency, which we're trying to sell for real life money. So basically, it is paid DLC, but crappy paid DLC. You know what DLC I want? I want story mode DLC. I want them to put out Vice City as like a... Kind of like a, I guess maybe like a side mission or something where you have to go to Vice City and do like missions there and you can play online in Vice City and they like completely remade it for Grand Theft Auto V. That's what I want and like a cool story mode missions, you know? Back in 2014, they said they were going to have more story mode missions, but it never came out and all they're doing is just promoting Grand Theft Auto Online and putting out overpriced toys for Grand Theft Auto Online to make you spend real life money on fake money in game. And honestly, that's just so shady. I don't expect this from a company like Rockstar. You're supposed to be legit. You're supposed to be awesome. And then you just, you just microtransaction world. That's all you are now. And it kind of sucks because that was a great game. But now it's just getting old and it's full of microtransaction. And it's changed way too much to be any fun. And that's really, really lame. I hope Rockstar really steps it up and focuses more on Grand Theft Auto 6 or Grand Theft Auto 5 DLC than working on microtransactions for Grand Theft Auto Online. Hold on, let me check real quick, because I really want to know, because it's so ridiculous how like, much price they cost. Yeah, $100, you can get $8 million in game cash. How rip-off is that? $100 for $8 million on Grand Theft Auto Online. That is an outrage. That is an outrage. At this point, Grand Theft Auto Online, it's just trash. They're just posting DLC so you can buy expensive shark cards and spend like insane amount of money for DLC. That is insane. They don't even have like, hey, spend $100 and you get every piece of DLC. Well, you know, it's just ridiculous, man. I think you see where I'm getting at. It is ridiculous and it pisses me off that they're ruining like the good name. Like, I don't kind of believe in Rockstar anymore. Like, imagine if Bethesda came out and it's like, oh yeah, you want to unlock the uh, armor pack in Fallout 4? Just buy our DLC cards, and you can use it for this amount of time. You know, it's just, I'm rambling, but it just bothers me, you know. I, I might be wrong, you guys might, you know, get money easy. You guys might have, you know, a click that you go with and play every day, and, you know, I just, I don't personally have time for that. So, it's just, it's kind of lame that someone that played this since it came out on 360 and also got it for PS4 can't really even enjoy the DLC for it because it's all overpriced. So, yeah, my opinion. Leave yours in the comments below. Like and subscribe if you're new here. I reply to most all the comments if there's something relevant and not hate. So, comment below and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.